Here we have a worksheet on telling time, and it says, Telling time to the hour. Write the correct time under each clock. Well, what we want to do is we want to look at where the shorthand or hour hand is pointing to. This one is pointing to the one. So right here in the front, we write one. Whenever the hand is pointing up to the 12, it's actually telling us it's zero, zero minutes. So we would say this clock is showing one o'clock. Here's how you read it on what we call an analog clock with the hands, and here's how you read it with a digital clock. So let's take a look. This one is pointing up to the 12, so we know the minutes are going to be zero, zero. This one's pointing up to the 12, the minutes are going to be zero, zero. This one, minute hand is pointing to the 12, so the minutes are zero, zero. This one, the minute hand is pointing up to the 12, we know it's zero, zero. And this one, we can see it's pointing up to the 12, we know the minutes are zero, zero. Whenever the hand is pointing to the 12, the minutes are zero. What we need to do is look at the shorthand and see what number it's pointing to. This one's pointing to three. That means this is three o'clock. This one's pointing to six. That means this one is six o'clock. This one is pointing to 11. That means this is 11 o'clock. This one is pointing to what number? It's pointing to the seven. That means it is seven o'clock. What hand is this number pointing to? The hour hand is pointing to the nine. And that means this clock says it's nine o'clock. And that's how we tell time to the hour.